Welcome back to our YouTube channel. If you are new here, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon to stay updated with our latest content. Let's talk about something super important today, digital security. It's kind of like locking your doors, but for your online life. We all spend so much time online, shopping, banking, connecting with friends. Our personal info is out there, and we definitely need to protect it. Think about it for a second. What would happen if someone got into your email? Or yikes, your bank account. Not good, right? That's why understanding online threats is absolutely key. One of the biggest threats is phishing, and that's exactly what we'll dive into today. We'll learn what phishing is and how to protect ourselves. Don't worry, it's really not as scary as it sounds. We'll use a cool tool called ZFisher to learn about phishing safely. Ready to level up your security game? Let's go. So, what exactly is phishing? It's one of the most common and dangerous tricks used by cyber criminals today, and it can target anyone, no matter how tech-savvy you are. Imagine getting an email that looks totally legit, like it's from your bank, a popular online store, or even a coworker you trust. The message might urge you to click a link to update your account info, reset your password, or claim a prize. But here's the catch, it's a trap. These emails are designed to look real, but they're actually fake. Clicking that link could take you to a fake website, carefully crafted to steal your passwords, credit card numbers, or other personal data without you even realizing it. Phishing is all about tricking people into giving up sensitive information, and it relies on human error rather than technical flaws. And honestly, it's more common than you might think. Every year, millions of phishing emails are sent out, and even big companies fall victim. That's where simulated phishing comes in. It's a proactive way to prepare yourself and your team for real threats. Think of it like a fire drill for your online life an exercise to test your awareness and response in a safe environment. By running safe, ethical simulations, we can learn how to spot these attacks in the real world before any real damage is done. Ethical hacking tools like ZFisher let us create these simulations, mimicking real phishing attempts without any risk. We can send out fake phishing emails to ourselves or our team to see who falls for it, and then use those results to improve our defenses. Don't worry, it's all done in a controlled environment. No real data is ever at risk, and the goal is always education, not punishment. The goal is to learn from our mistakes, build better defenses, and make sure everyone is prepared to spot and stop phishing attacks before they succeed. Meet ZFisher, your new cybersecurity buddy. Whether you're just starting out or already have some experience, this tool is designed to help you understand the world of phishing in a safe and controlled way. This awesome tool is kind of like a Swiss army knife for ethical phishing simulations. It packs a ton of features into one easy to use package, making it a favorite among cybersecurity enthusiasts and professionals alike. It's powerful, versatile, and honestly perfect for learning the ropes. You can experiment with different phishing techniques and see firsthand how these attacks work, all without any real-world risk. ZFisher lets you create all sorts of phishing scenarios. From classic email scams to more advanced social engineering tricks, you can simulate a wide range of attacks to test your skills or train your team. Want to test if your team will fall for a fake Google login page? ZFisher can totally do that. It even provides templates for popular sites so you can make your simulations as realistic as possible. How about a fake social media message asking for your password? ZFisher's got you covered. You can customize your campaigns to mimic real-world threats and see how people respond. It even lets you track who clicked the link and how the attack played out. This way, you can analyze results, identify vulnerabilities, and improve your defenses over time. The best part? ZFisher is super easy to use, even if you're brand new to cybersecurity. Its user-friendly interface means you can get started quickly without needing to be a tech expert. It runs on Kali Linux, which is a really popular operating system for ethical hacking. Kali is trusted by security professionals worldwide for its reliability and powerful tools. We'll walk through the installation process together in the next section, so you'll be up and running in no time. Don't worry if you've never used Kali before, I'll guide you every step of the way. 
And remember, with great power comes great responsibility. Always use Zeese Fisher ethically and legally, respecting privacy and the law. Let's get started on your journey to becoming a cybersecurity pro. All right, let's get our hands dirty and install Z Fisher. First things first, make sure you have Kali Linux 2025 up and running. You can download it from the official website if you haven't already. Once you're in Kali, open up your terminal. Now type in the following command and hit enter. Git clone http slash github.com slash htrtech slash zfisher.git. This will download the latest version of zfisher from github. Next, navigate to the zfisher directory using cd fisher. Finally, run this command to install zfisher bash zfisher.sh. You'll see some installation messages pop up. Once it's done, congrats! You've successfully installed zfisher on your Kali Linux 2025 machine. Now let's move on to the fun part, setting up our first phishing simulation. With zfisher installed, it's time to launch the tool and craft our first simulation. In your terminal, simply type zfisher and hit enter. You'll be greeted by the zfisher welcome screen. It's pretty self-explanatory. You'll see a menu with different options for creating phishing pages, sending emails, and more. For our first simulation, let's keep it simple. Choose a pre-built template, like the classic Google login page. Zfisher will ask you to customize a few things, like the email subject and the URL where you want to redirect victims. Don't worry, we'll use a safe one. Remember, the goal here is to make the email look as convincing as possible. Think about what would fool you if you weren't paying attention. Once you're happy with the setup, Zfisher will generate everything you need. You're now ready to launch your first simulated phishing campaign. Before you hit the launch button on your first simulated phishing campaign, let's take a moment to talk about safety, responsibility, and ethics. Running a phishing simulation is a powerful learning tool, but it must always be done with care and respect for everyone involved. Remember, this exercise is strictly for educational purposes only. The goal is to raise awareness and improve security, not to trick or embarrass anyone. Never target anyone without their explicit, informed consent. Always make sure participants know what to expect and agree to be part of the simulation. For your first run, it's best to send the phishing email to your own account or to a friend or colleague who is fully aware of the exercise and has agreed to participate. This keeps things safe and controlled. When composing the email, make it absolutely clear that this is a simulation. Add a bold disclaimer in the message so there's no confusion or unnecessary alarm. Include a clear explanation of the exercise's purpose and provide tips on how to recognize phishing attempts in the future. This helps everyone learn and stay vigilant. Once your email is sent, monitor the results using zfisher or your chosen tool. Watch for who interacts with the email and how they respond. You'll be able to see valuable data, like how many people click the link what information, if any, was entered, and how convincing your phishing page appeared. This feedback is essential for understanding the effectiveness of your simulation. After the simulation, gather everyone who participated for a debrief. This is your chance to review the results together and discuss what happened. Talk about what worked well, what could be improved, and share strategies for spotting and avoiding real phishing attacks in the future. Encourage open discussion and questions. This debriefing session is crucial for reinforcing good cybersecurity habits, building team awareness, and making sure everyone feels confident about defending against real threats. Hold on a minute. Before you get carried away with your newfound phishing skills, let's talk about ethics and the law. Using Zfisher or any hacking tool for malicious purposes is a big no-no. We're talking serious consequences here. Always obtain explicit consent before sending simulated phishing emails. Transparency is key. Let people know they're part of a cybersecurity exercise and explain the purpose. Never, ever use Zfisher to target individuals or organizations without their permission. Remember, just because you can do something doesn't mean you should. Use your powers for good. By staying ethical and legal, you'll be contributing to a safer online world for everyone.
Simulated phishing isn't just a fun cybersecurity exercise. It's a powerful tool used by companies and organizations worldwide to train employees and strengthen their defenses against real-world attacks. Imagine a large bank wants to educate its employees about phishing scams targeting customer data. They can use Zfisher to create a realistic simulation, mimicking a common phishing email. By running this simulation, the bank can identify employees who might fall for such scams and provide them with additional training. In another scenario, a government agency wants to test its incident response capabilities to a sophisticated phishing campaign targeting its officials. They can use Zfisher to create a highly targeted simulation, mimicking the tactics of real-world attackers. This allows the agency to assess its preparedness, identify vulnerabilities, and improve its incident response protocols. Congratulations on completing your crash course in simulated phishing with Zfisher. You've taken a big step towards becoming more security aware, and that's awesome. Remember, cybersecurity is an ongoing journey, not a destination. Let's recap some key takeaways and best practices. Think before you click. Don't blindly trust emails or links, even if they look legit. Check the sender. Look for misspellings or suspicious email addresses. Hover over links. Before clicking, hover your mouse over the link to see the actual URL. Use strong passwords. A strong, unique password is your first line of defense. Enable two-factor authentication. Add an extra layer of security to your accounts. By staying vigilant, using the right tools, and continuously learning, you can stay ahead of the bad guys and protect your digital life. Stay safe out there, and keep those